Hey guys, this is Jerry Ors. Abigail Zoe Lewis. Hola amigos, soy Michelle Contreras. Hi, I'm Nathaniel B. Hey everyone, this is me Morgan Birch. A crowning achievement from Leica Studios. I thought the plot was very well done and very well directed. Today we're reviewing the absolutely phenomenal film, Doctor Strange. I must say that my favorite part of this film has to be the visuals. From the live action, to the CGI, to the visuals of watercoloring, I find detail in every one. Animation was colorful, the storyline was engaging, and the characters were fun to watch. I also liked how the cat rhymed and sang. Disney's Alice Through the Looking Glass is a magical fantasy adventure. The animation was by far the best I've ever seen. Five out of five star rating because it shows kids that you don't have to be big to do big things. These amazing Tall Tale legends were created in the 1800s. They are still perfectly amazing and wonderful to this day. This is one of my favorite Marvel movies because it might have the best animation in the world. Very comically to set us up for later films that will be darker. And even in this film, there are some really dark moments. Francis is an excellent film with outstanding performances from Viola Davis and Denzel Washington. Zootopia is one of the best animated films I've ever seen. They struggle themselves trying to use their brilliance in a world where you get defined by your skin color. I love this movie because of the excellent acting. The message of this TV show is to believe in yourself and help others. This is such a wonderful film that has fantastic elements in it from top-notch special effects to absolutely beautiful acting and a wonderful story. I love this movie for its CGI's and characters. Now, hands down, the best actor in this movie has got to be Michael Keaton. Both a strong bond throughout the film and their personality complements each other. So this is the fifth installment in the Ice Age movie franchise. I enjoyed the storyline, the action-packed scenes, the mystery, the crime, the suspense, everything. These are very believable. You can really see the love between the two brothers, as well as the anger and disbelief from Ray Kroc. Hello, Diego. Hi. How are you? Hi. Can you tell me a little bit about the movie? About your character in the movie? I can tell you a lot about my character in the movie. It's Cassian Andor. It's, mm -hmm. uh, it's a captain. It's, um, you were the last audition, and this is your first film ever, and you happen to just land it with Disney. How was your reaction to that? Crazy. I, <laughs> I still can't believe it. Mm -hmm. What was it like to apply your fatherly qualities to the kids that you were working with on set? Well, I have a daughter especially. You know, I have four boys and then a girl, and I did this film very much as a love letter to her. So Tomorrowland is known as a place where anything is possible. What does Tomorrowland mean in you, for you? Uh, it means to me, uh, uh, something, tomorrow is, is ephemeral. It's something that's not here yet. Uh, is this your first time at the Kids' Choice Awards? This is my first time at the Kids' Choice Awards. Do you hope to get slimed? I do not hope to get slimed. I was, when I was uh, about your age, I loved to draw. I never thought about making movies, but when I went to college, I took an animation class, an introduction to animation. Girl in a real situation, although what we see of her is very far removed from what my last film was, um, it is incredibly something that's happening right now in the world. Millions of kids are going to see this movie. What message do you want them to take away from it? Well, just that there's uh, a lot of love in cooking, and there's a lot of cooking and love and that I think this is a very, very sweet, delightful story about family and about the differences between our cultures, but how we can bring our cultures together simply by sitting down and sharing a meal together. What message do you want them to take away from this film? The very, the, the very idea that you can mesh these cultures through food and uh, blend them in such a way that you, you have real connection and see that we are all more alike than we're different, I love that. I love 